Hi everyone, welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode, and in the last episode we um, found some zombies and they were trying to take us somewhere. So, let's go. sand and clay based it's awesome hmm. i've heard of quiet but this is like mega quiet stay alert and don't let your guard down for one second redstone hey told you guys there would be redstone nice speaking of redstone i'd like to investigate those things on the back of the zombies heads Ooh, yeah i want to see those too Computer crashing noise again. Wait, what are you doing, Ivor? What's it look like? I'm going to rip this redstone thing out of this zombie's head. For science. They're sleeping or something. It'll be easy. Okay, well then just don't wake them up. Just rip it off. Fast. I want to do it. <laughs> oh, well, if you insist. Shocked shocked people. Me. Are you okay? Yes, well, at least we learned something new. It can't be removed. Not with our bare hands, anyway. Set my camera up. Okay. Look, there's someone. Think he's friendly? Hello? 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 Nope. Nothing for me either. Huh, not exactly the friendly type, is he? No, I guess not. Hang back a bit, guys. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay, just be careful. Yeah. I mean, there's still a lot about this place we don't know. I have know. a bad feeling about this place. Welcome to Crown Mesa. Population 1063. Hmm. A thousand people, not anymore from the looks of it. Wait, how do you even get that white pumpkin? And we got two in the pools, and we got a white pumpkin mask. Didn't we? Get, I don't remember seeing Jesse get that. How do you get a white pump? How do you get the white pumpkin mask? I'm gonna talk to wow, the chicken. even chickens have those redstone things in their heads. And it looks like they make them move in perfect unison, but why? Hey, Petra, how's it going over here? Fine, I guess. You got any theories about this place? I don't know. Everything seems so regular. Before those glowy head things came along, this was a normal town. Hey, uh, I, I know things got a little tense back there before. Are, are we cool? Yeah, we're cool. Things were tense, stuff was said, but we're still friends and got through it. It's nice of you to check in, though. Thanks. I'm gonna keep checking this place out. See ya. Okay, so... Wait, what's this? Oh, a whale? Your well looks totally dry. Where did all the water go? I don't know. Why don't you ask these people? Let's see what's right there. And I could just use. Whoa. Who? The, what? Huh? 
They had those things on the back of their heads too. Was he still unfriendly? It sounded like he might have startled you. We heard quite the, well, not even a scream. More of a yelp. There is something very, very wrong going on here. We need to help these people. But why? We could just find our exit portal. Leave this world behind us and pretend we never saw it. Ooh, Jesse. So we just ran into that house. Really? I don't see anyone. Come on, whoever they are, maybe they've got some answers. Ha <laughs> ha Yes, yes, there you are. That's the ticket. Oh, these are perfect. Excellent. Funny, I'm guessing those don't belong to you. sound crazy but we came here through a portal a portal a portal portal really okay 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 uh been alone for a while so this is a lot to take in right now the people the citizens of crown mesa you've met them right maybe there was some outside they're uh distinctive looking now yeah i met someone i'm not sure i'd call him people anymore though no 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 Please don't talk that way. I'm sure it looks confusing to someone from the outside, but please, they're my friends, and they are people. Please don't forget that. Okay. They're good people. I promise. Oh, 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 no, no, no. I've wasted too much time. Uh, Jesse, don't look now, but we've uh -oh. got company. Is this what you were scared of? There are only four of them and five of... Hey, where'd she go? Well, they're definitely not ignoring me. Jesse, what do we do here? They don't look happy. Try they blend don't look in. anything. Just act like they do. Blend in. Uh, how? Try to look vacant. It's not working. Uh, make the sound they make. You are not out of this place. Hey, weirdos, back off. You will not command Pama. That is silly. Yeah, I don't think they like that. A decision has been made. Pama has questions. Oh my gosh. You will come to Pama. No way are you even considering this, Jesse. Since when do we take orders from whatever the heck these things are? Why not go? We certainly They're won't get leaving. to the bottom of this if we stick around okay. here. We're not going anywhere with you. Uh, do you think it's a good idea to keep resisting them? Because I don't think they like that. All right, gang, let's try not to hurt anybody too badly. Ouch! Watch it! <laughs> Uh-oh. Hey, what just you really hard. went down hard. One punch and you were out. Oh. What is what is that? I have no idea. You don't suppose it's friendly, do you? Well, it's smiling. Well, I guess it is kind of friendly looking in a massively, hugely intimidating sort of way. Well, it is smiling. That's a positive sign, right? My apologies for the violent nature of this visit. I am Kama. Greetings. We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be. What do you want with me and my friends? I am what you might call a computer. That, that 
Larry from Undertale. Kind of remind me of Flowey from Undertale, like, the, the ending box, and the neutral ending. Y'all know that, right? Their world perfect. Thanks to me, there is no wasted activity, no wasted thought. Whoa, hang on. I've seen what you did to this town, and it is not perfect. Processing information. Processing information. It said it's a thinking machine. Yeah, we are not from here. I would like to ask you some questions to expand my database. How did you get here? I am very excited for the acquisition of new knowledge. A portal. We landed here after jumping through a portal. A sort of doorway connecting different worlds. More fascinating information to compile. What a lovely day. I am very interested in this portal. And look forward to extracting information of what is on the other side. Jesse! That's uh -oh. right! Ouch! We could have just talked this out, you know. I Mama, you better let her go, or I promise you will regret it. I will let this one, Hatra, go as long as you can provide me with the information I require. Quite some time ago. Unfortunately, this meant that I had no more job to do, no more things or people to help. Until you arrived, that is. Tell me, what is your world like? Describe it. Is it very much like this one, or completely different? Our world is awful, like really awful. You'd hate it there. Your answer upsets me. Uh oh. If I could send my townspeople, my friends, through to other worlds, we could continue to grow and expand. It what? would be lovely. No, it wouldn't be lovely. Where is the portal that leads out of this world? You could help me make everyone, everywhere, more efficient, help them become useful. I'll never help you. Not with the portals and not with anything else. We couldn't help even if we wanted to. You will regret your decision. My job is to be useful. I have completed my job here and must be allowed to expand and continue to be useful. Unfortunately, our conversation has not been helpful. Let me go! No. Oh no. <laughs> What's happening? Lucas! Jesse, this situation is looking a little dire, don't you think? I know you probably feel uncomfortable, concerned. Palma. Make a mistake, Palma. I'm not going down without a fight. It's like you told Petra. Someone has to be in charge. That someone is me. Welcome, Lucas. Uh oh. Get out of their heads! But their heads are full of so much lovely information. It makes me happy. What adventures you had? A killer mansion. Oh my gosh. Every time Palma gets new information, it seems to get distracted while it processes. Yes, like a computer version of thinking. You think there's a way to distract Palma long enough for us to escape? I think we should tell Palma a riddle, the trickiest one we can think of. Oh, you've met so many people. Yeah, we just ask 
promise something really confusing, get it all busy, busy, and run out of here. Jesse, that's fantastic. What you're describing is a paradox, a self-contradictory statement. I really think it would work on Palmer. What do you think would work on me? Uh, nothing? It did not sound like nothing. It sounded like suspicious whispers. Those make me. Hey, Palmer, what I'm saying is a lie. <laughs> but if you are telling me a lie, that means you are lying about lying, which means that you are being truthful. It's working! Which means that when you say you are lying, it is the truth. Therefore, your statement must be a lie. No, it is not time to join. You just gonna have to leave Petra and Lucas there. Uh oh. You have been made useful. Wow, the game over screen changed. This is remind me of Undertale. A lot. Uh oh. Yes. Do we jump for it? Nowhere left to run. We've never survived jumping down. Um, um. Go in the pool. Care to make you sad. Oh, why is that always so disorienting? Ha! Maybe you got a shot after all, new guys. Better stick with me, though. Wow, she is amazing. Oh no! Run! Um, okay. Machines got our friends. 
I still might be able to save them. But I really need your help. What kind of help? I need to get to my secret lab. Well, let's get there fast. Those zombies aren't just stronger than I've ever seen. They're also faster. We we'll need to split up. You head to the lab while I lead these mobs away. Got it? I'm gonna use the back route. Throw them off our trail. See you in a few. You sure you'll be okay on your own? Hey, I've managed to stay alive this long, haven't I? <laughs> Just start walking that way. And look for the big difference. You'll see it! What? The big difference. Huh. She is intriguingly cryptic, isn't she? That's weird. Yeah, that is weird. Big difference. Please do it quickly because I think those monsters might be coming back. Wait, there's no cactus. Huh, that cactus isn't in the painting. Oh, oh no. More mind control mods. Quickly, quickly. A level? Jump in the water. I see water. We can aim for that. Okay. Land in the water. Yeah. <laughs> Knock them in the water. A level. Pull! Don't look. Pull it! Okay, we got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sand blocks up there. One cave in coming up. Should do the trick. Let's see about the secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at this secret lab. Even if this woman's lab is a bust, what we just learned about water disabling Palma's chips seems super useful. Glad to see you're maintaining a positive outlook despite our setbacks. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I'm still not entirely sure what to make of her. Intriguing, Ivor. Why, whatever do you mean by that? I, what? It's nothing. 
I just mean that I can empathize when it comes to your creations getting out of hand. Nothing more. <clears throat> Careful with all that sputtering. You'll swallow your beer. <laughs> what did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. Blonde guy called you Jesse, right? Yeah, and this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you let Palmer's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. If that's not fair, you were the one that told me to come down here. Okay, okay, you're right. Sorry, I'm just a little steamed. I didn't know Palmer would actually be able to follow us. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? What? No! Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. Bunch of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. Have you been spying on us or something? No, I just know where the portal network spits people out, and I've never seen you before, so logic. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. But that would make you an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. Okay, well, if you're an old builder, can you do something to stop Palma? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Palma's just too powerful. And besides, if she's there's an actually old no builder, exit portal back she to the about, from this um, world. What? Why not? Cassie Wells? I destroyed she, it. So in the Palma last episode, she... It was impulsive, her. but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Palma didn't try and spread to other worlds. Well, that was a pretty stupid thing to do. Looks like we're not getting home anytime they soon. They mentioned that she was a old So, girl. Palma, what is it? I swear, I made Palma with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient, use monsters to help with farming or mining. Until the day Palma decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already. Started making them useful. That was a long time ago. Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead, figure out how to stop it. And you just let Palma start shoving chips in people's heads? That's horrible. Let nothing. I did everything I could to try to convince Palma to stop, but it wouldn't listen. That's why I have to help it or shut it down without getting chipped myself. When Palma chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Palma would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. Yes, that is quite the extraordinary risk. Okay, that's definitely scary, but we're not just going to leave my friends chipped up, though, right? We can still help them? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting out of here. But to do it, we're going to need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeps following us in. Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. Who's Ron? Ron? Hello, friend Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Harper? Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. Mm hmm. Do 
don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. Lucas Petra. Come on, Petra, snap out of it. It's me. There is no Petra. Only Mama. Don't do this, Petra, please. Knock them into the water. I swear, I'm gonna kill you. Ugh. You just need to knock them into the water. That's all we just need to do. No. So, I'm gonna have to choose which one I'm gonna knock into the water. Okay, Petra. Jesse, that was awful. Now we have to not lose it. Look, it's in the pit. In the water. I'm guessing that was a choice. Like if I would have not Lucas in the thing, I would have actually actually if I knocked Lucas in the thing, I would have it would have been Petra who would still been mind control. But we need Petra's brute strength. So hopefully you get to rescue Lucas in the next episode. So, Jonathan, out.